Hello everybody and welcome back. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you guys enjoyed yesterday's video of my little day trip to the Shed Aquarium. I had so much fun with that. It was just absolutely something perfect to do right after, you know, a really crazy busy weekend and a stressful couple of weeks. It was it was awesome, but I am ready to get back down to some fun crafting. I'm actually um, <laughs> starting another glue book today. Yeah, yeah, this is another another glue book. I have this really cute uh, spiral bind uh, notebook, and I'm going to call this my memories glue book, and let me explain why. Since being off of work, and, you know, now that the craft fair is done, I've been in this, like, super hardcore cleaning organizing mode. And so I was going through uh, some of my bookshelves, and I came across all of my wonderful file folders here. As you can see, I went through a bit of a Lisa Frank phase as a teenager. And these file folders are all filled with, like, little snippets, tidbits, and memories. I've got maps. I've got little drawings. I've got lists. I've got magazine snippets. I've got, I even have a, an old scorecard from when I went and played laser tag. So these, these things are just filled with lots of like childhood memories and fun little pictures and doodles and notes from friends and family. And and like, I'm just like, I haven't taken these out in a very long time. I can't even really, I'm not sure what's in all of these. And I'd kind of like to get them off my shelf. Just, you know, just get rid of them because I haven't, I haven't gone through them. So I thought, I want to go through all of these. I want to keep the things that have really good memories and get rid of the stuff that's just not relevant anymore. And so I thought I would glue everything that I really like and want to keep memory-wise in its own glue book. So that is what I'm going to be starting. I'm going to be going through all of these. I'm not going to go through it really fast or quick. It's just, you know, something that's going to be, you know, relaxing and fun, you know, taking a trip down memory lane, seeing what I have in here. I've got some old camp pictures, I think, in here. These are probably not going to fit on my, uh, these aren't going to, these are from camp when I went to camp as a young teenager. I don't even know where I'm at in this. Uh, I have no idea where. I think I'm hidden in the back somewhere. Yeah, I'm in. I'm, I'm gonna get rid of, rid of these because, um, to be quite honest, I did not have a very good time at camp. Camp does not hold very good memories for me, so I will not. I will not keep these. I know some of you are saying, "No, I'll keep them as memories." Like, this is not good memories. They're not good memories. If they don't hold good memories, don't keep them. So like I even have, uh, I went to a couple concerts and I had some people sign some pictures. So I've got a couple of these. I don't know how I'm going to fit these. I might be able to fit these on here. I don't know. Let me see. Would these be able to fit? I might have to trim her down. And then I've got this one here. I can't remember what this was. I don't even know who these, who these guys are, what band this was from. This was years ago. I was like a young teenager, so... Lots of, lots of stuff in a lot of these things. So, um, yeah, I've got a, oh gosh, I've really got to go through so many things. Uh, I'm going to get rid of that. I don't even remember what that is. Let me, let me actually just find some things that I can glue down. Because a lot of these are probably going to be, you know, still sifting through. Let's see, do I have anything I can glue down? There might be some things in here. Mm, let me see. I've got, oh, this could be glued down. Don't remember where that came from. Oh, there's something here. Oh, it's a postcard. Okay. All right, I've got some things in here that I saved. Oh, I've got some recipes. i got some fun recipes. I remember these. But I might put those, I actually have like a special little book that I saved for, um, all our recipes and such. So there's something I can glue down. We'll start, start with some, yeah. That's just, oh, I, I love snipping out cute little, um, look, I love cutting things out like these out of magazines. So uh, here's some, here's some cute things. See, 
Look how pretty some of these are. Aren't these gorgeous? I love these kind of figurines. So, yep, I can totally glue these down. Absolutely. Let's get these pulled out. I love these figurines. They're really cool. Oh, okay. Oh, here is a, a ticket stub. I got lots of ticket stubs, too. Oh, here. I remember this family vacation. And that, too. And what is this? Oh, we also went to a Dinosaur World in Cave City, Kentucky. So I got the map. <laughs> this is this is pretty awesome. So I can glue that down too. Don't know what to do about that because it's got things on the back. Hmm. Maybe what I could do is tape it just along the top so you can still flip it up and see the back side or on the side here like this. If I tape it along the side, then I can flip it like that. That's a good idea. Ooh, ooh, oh, here's a kitty. I'll have to put that in my cat glue book. Forgot about that. Oh, I remember these from vacation. I can glue those down. All right, I got a good start here. Let's, let's not get overwhelmed because I could easily get overwhelmed with a lot of this, a lot of stuff in these, in these file folders. It's like they're, oh, they're heavy and they are packed full. So let's just start, start off simple here. Let's start off with a couple of these little, little cards here. Let me see, I might put those on the other page. Yep. We'll just start. It is a very cold, rainy, misty, yucky day. Although, I don't mind this kind of weather. I actually put on my raincoat and my boots and I went for a walk out in it. It was very refreshing because it smelled so like fresh and clean. So, and it wasn't technically really that cold because it wasn't windy. So, it didn't really, you didn't feel the cold because there was no wind. It was just very, very still. There was just a very, very light mist out there. And so uh, it didn't, it doesn't bother me. And this, I I grew up with this kind of weather. It doesn't, that's just my personality. That is who I am. So I do not mind this kind of weather. I really don't. And I don't think I ever will, hopefully. It won't ever bother me. We went to like dolphin encounters and the Bahamas. That was when we did a family cruise years ago. Like it was a fun experience, but oh my gosh, it was a, let's just say I got a seasick several times. I, uh, yeah, tried the, uh, the motion sickness pills, but the thing is, is I was so sick, I couldn't even keep them down. I kept throwing them up. So yeah, I don't ever want to go on a cruise again. I don't ever want to do that. I'd rather say I did it. It it was okay. I mean, it was it was fun experiences when you weren't on the boat. When you were not on the boat, yes, doing all the sights and the things in the Bahamas was great. But then once you got back on the boat, it was like, oh my gosh, get me off the boat. It was it was really rough. It was really rough. Come on, stay stuck. Stay sticking down. It's a very thick, very thick card, so hopefully it stays, stays stuck. I think I might just have to, like, um, put some weighted books on it or something. All right, and I'm going to put stuff on both front and back to try and get as much as I can into this. All right, and this I might have to, um, like, tape here so that I can flip it open. Because I like to see the back of that, so I'm going to set that aside here. Let's see, diamond, historic diamond caverns. I don't remember where this was at, but here's a another little ticket. And I don't really care about the back. I'm just going to care about the front. So, yeah. I mean, this is, this is a great way to really, you know, save a lot of those other... I don't know how many of you guys actually have, like, a, a memory glue book. Like, do you save, like, little tickets and stubs and maps? Or do you have, like, little doodles and drawings... Do you have like um, notes from friends or little pictures or the 
magazine cutouts of certain things that you really, really like or stuff that you saved from a long time ago. Do you, do you have them all glued into a book or do you just have them saved into like a little box or a file folder? Because I've had a lot of this stuff all in file folders for years. Like literal years. A lot of these images are all from when I was a teenager. I kid you not, a teenager. I'm kind of wondering if I want to just cut out that image or just trim it up and use the whole. I think I might just trim it up and use the whole thing. You know, I think I actually remember doing something similar to a glue book when I was a teenager. Because I, I did. I used to love saving cute little pictures and images from like ad magazines and ads in the newspaper. Actually, there's going to be some like newspaper articles that I saved in, in these folders because... They were just really, really cute stories. I really liked them. So uh, those might end up in here too. I don't know. And uh, I'm not trying to, you know, worry about organizing any of it. I'm not gonna like keep like, like cute little pictures on, on one page or all the ticket stubs on another page. I'm just gluing it all down. I am not concerned with what goes where. None of that. Nope, we are not messing with that. Don't remember where this came from, but it was just a really cute saying. Orion, what are you doing? Sorry, guys. My cat, my kitty cat, Orion, is got the zoomies. I have got dinner in the oven already. I am making a vegetable lasagna. My dad got those from uh, work for free. So I'm like, yeah, give me. They're my favorite. So uh, it takes about over an hour to bake. So I got it in the oven right now. So by the time I'm done playing here, I'm going to be pretty hungry. Yep. Okay, let's see what a little. Oh, some of these are so cute. Really, really cute. Hmm. I'm gonna trim this down a bit. I can get it to fit like right there, actually. That's perfect. What I should really do is like just take everything out of the file folders and just stick it all into like a basket so that I can uh, sift through it later. Otherwise, in the meantime, I just got to stick all those folders back on my shelf. And I'm like, I'd rather have that shelf space now for other things. So that might be what I do. I might take everything, take everything off, take it all out. Now I can go through it and actually get rid of the stuff that I, you know, really don't want to keep. Hmm. Let me go through another one. Let's see, what else do I have in there? Ooh, you'd think I'd learn to put the cap back on the glue stick. See, I also save a lot of things from magazines. I got lots of, I got lots of magazine snippets in here. I actually should just put this, this all into my, uh, into my actual glue books. Like, why did I save this one? What is in here? Oh, that's why. I saved this cool picture. I don't know why I did that. I watched that movie. I actually had that movie, but I didn't really like it. I, I didn't like it. So I don't know why I saved this. I mean, yeah, it is a really cool, really cool kind of poster, cartoonish, but I might actually get rid of that because I didn't like that movie. All right. Let's see, what else do we have saved in here? I know I saved it for like pictures or articles or something. Let's see. What is this? Oh, High School Musical. Now this I probably will keep 
because I liked High School Musical. It was it was a, it's just a fun fun movie, really fun. The thing is, is it's too big to put in a glue book. Unless you know, I I can get a little creative here. Hang on, do I have time to get a little creative? I might I might have time to get a little creative with this. Okay. No, I'm just gonna stuff a bunch of this all back in here. We'll, we'll mess with it later. Okay, okay. I'm gonna get creative, guys. You watch, you watch, you watch this. First things first, I'm gonna trim off the edges to make it nice. That's also to just kind of get rid of some of the excess. We're gonna make it fit. I can't remember when the first High School Musical came out. It was like all the rage. Nothing, nothing beats the first one though. Like I think they made two more. Like yeah, there's High School Musical one and, or two and three yet. But nothing, nothing really beats the uh, the first one. Okay, let's get this edges trimmed up. Oh. And then you will see see some magic. See some magic fun. I'm going to fold it in half again, where it's supposed to be folded. I've got a little, little wrinkled here. Let's turn to a new page here so that there's room for it. Okay, need it back here. All right, so it's folded in half. See how it's not gonna really, not gonna really fit. Okay, but, 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 what I'm gonna do is I'm going to fold it again, just like this here, just like this. Okay, so you see, it's folded like this. And it opens up like this. Okay, right. I'm going to glue just this section back here. Okay, do you, do you see where I'm going here? I'm gonna make sure that I got exactly where I want it. Do you see where it's going? I think you guys can figure it out. I think you can see where it's going here. Go ahead and get this all glued down real quick here. Make sure I gotta get all the way to the edges. All right, and then let's see. I think I can, I might just, do I wanna stick it right in the center or off the side? Let's do it off the side so I can still squeeze more stuff in here. All right. Glue it down. Let's close this back up safely here. <laughs> All right, all right, and then we can still open her up and take a peek. Check that out. Oh, yes, yes. So then there is a way where you can still save some of your, like, big magazine articles or, like, big posters or, you know, stuff like this. You could just, you just have to do a little creative folding and then just glue a little bit there, but yay! Well, I'm loving this already so far. I, I am. I'm. I'm. Don't know why I haven't done this sooner. I honestly don't. I, I really don't. Cause I mean, I used to do stuff like this as a teenager. I, I really would. I would have like little books or papers where I would glue all kinds of stuff on it. I don't know why. I never thought to keep doing that with all of these snippets and things that I saved. I just. I. I don't. <laughs> Well, there you have it, guys, my memories glue book. But we are not done yet, actually. No, no, no. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna open up a little piece of happy mail. I went and stopped my P.O. box today and I found this cutie in there. This is from Catherine Windsor. Catherine, see, looky, looky, I got your, I got your little, your gift. Thank you so much. I am loving 
this washi tape. The background is pink with black kitties on it. Oh my gosh. I, I love, I need. So we're going to open up just a little bonus happy mail today. Really super excited about that. All right. Thank you again, Catherine, for your little happy mail gift. I truly appreciate it. Got a nice, nice little, little gift in here. All right, I'm gonna read what it says. Aww. Aww, thank you so much, Catherine. Oh, thank you, honey. Thank you so much. She's giving me some little cat images to start in my cat glue book, which will be coming, by the way. I've got a book, all right? So make sure you subscribe so you can, you know, get notified when that video comes up. We have a cat glue book coming. We do, we do. Oh, look at some. Oh, my gosh. Where did you get some of these kitties? Oh, and then, oh, yes, those are cats, too. Absolutely. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> that is like the perfect setting to put one of those like little speech bubbles and a funny saying on it. I will have to, I know there's stickers out there for that. There's got to be some stickers, those little speech bubble stickers that have funny sayings on it. And they, like for that, these would be the perfect images for those funny, funny memes, funny speech bubble stickers. Oh, look at mama and babies. Oh my gosh, look at how cute it is. Oh, it's a, it's a little, oh, it's a postcard. Okay, and there's some tiny, smaller stuff in here. Let's see what we have. Oh, cat stickers. Look at all the cute little babies. Oh, oh, I love all these. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, no pun intended. It's perfect. I'm hungry, guys, okay? I'm getting delirious with hunger. Oh, my gosh. That is so adorable. Oh, my gosh. I can't. I can't even. I can't. I'm, I'm losing it, guys. I'm losing it. Look at how cute. Oh. Catterday. Catterday. Yes. Every day is Catterday. When you have a cat, every day is Catterday. Oh, so look. Three-dimensional ones. Oh, they're so cute. Oh. Well, thank you so much, Catherine, for your for your little contribution to my cat glue book. I am super excited to get that started. It will be coming up, you guys. I'm not sure if it'll be this week. I, I don't know. I've got so many ideas, so many movies, videos that I want to do now. And I'm like, I'm overwhelmed. Like, what do I start with? I don't know where to start. So, yeah, lots of good stuff to come. So make sure you like and subscribe, stay tuned, leave a comment, all that fun jazz. I am here pretty much every single day. Just letting you know, I will not be posting a video on Thursday because that is Thanksgiving Day. It is a day to just rest, relax, be thankful for everything, and to spend time with the friends and family. So make sure you just, you know, do that. Try to stay off of social media, basically. It's like, let's just stay away from social media on Thanksgiving Day if we could, because that's not where your your family is. You're 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 in the presence of your family. You're 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 legit like you know standing next to them. Hopefully standing next to friends or family on Thanksgiving, and so it's like yeah, put the phones down. We're gonna we're gonna try and put the phones down on Thanksgiving Day. Okay, we may take those for granted. We definitely do. All right. Well, with that being said, guys, it is time to say goodbye for today. And thanks again, Catherine, for your wonderful little gift. I love them so much. Oh, you know what? I might just have to, you know, do this tomorrow. I think I think we're going to start the cat glue book tomorrow. And yeah, so, yep. All right, guys, you have a wonderful evening. And I will see you in tomorrow's video. All right? Keep on gluing, guys.